talking about. Does that compare at all to what your level of confidence was a year ago? Uh, I mean, it's pretty, I mean, pretty much the same thing. I mean, in March, you got your confidence got to be at an all-time high. And, uh, I mean, one thing that Coach Carroll said: don't wait, don't wait for anything later. Uh, so we kind of wanted to come in this game and impose our will early, and uh, I think we did. We kind of broke them early. What was so good about the offense today? It's the best shooting you guys have had all year. Two twelve zero runs. Mm -hmm. I think just moving it, everybody touching it. Um, guys not getting cold. Um, when everybody's touching, like I've, like I've, like I've been stating for the past couple of games, when everybody's touching it, everybody has confidence. So when you're making the right play out there, you're probably gonna make the shots. So. Do you uh, have a different feel when the ACC tournament is in the state of North Carolina? Does it feel different at all? <laughs> I mean, kind of feels back to my freshman year when we played here at Greensboro. Obviously, we, we couldn't uh, we couldn't finish the tournament because we got disqualified. But uh, I mean, it's kind of it's kind of that same feel that home that home North Carolina vibe. So it's like a lot of Duke fans out here too. So they're, they're showing mad love too. You weren't worried at all when Flip went down, were you? Nah, he's tough. <laughs> nah, he's tough. I knew he was gonna come right back. What do you think about facing Miami again? After especially after the last time you played? Them? Yeah, I mean, I just think they haven't seen us yet for real. I mean, obviously we didn't have our full team when we played them. Dariq was out. Um, we, we're, just, we're just so much better now, so I mean, got to keep that going and uh, do the same thing for Miami tomorrow. Lock it for them. Was that Miami game a turning point for you guys? I think the it was definitely a turning point. I mean, obviously, we learned a lot of lessons from that game, but I think the UVA game was really a turning point for us. And that I think that was pretty much the same week. That was a Monday Saturday game, so that week was definitely a big a big time week for us. <coughs> Thanks, Jeremy. You better believe we're going to come out with the chip on our shoulder just like we did today. Looking at Miami tomorrow, what are you guys seeing in them watching you play other than that? I mean, you know, they're a great team. Uh, they play together really well. But I mean, we're just focused on us, and we're gonna come out there, guns are blazing, ready to, to go at them because you know we're we're winning this ACC championship, so that's exactly what we're gonna do. Jeremy said that his team today is much different than you guys played than the last time. Would you agree? And if so, in what ways? Yeah, I, I would definitely agree. Um, I, I would say just kind of with our mentality. Uh, going into games, you know, being on the same page, not really having any doubt creep in. You know, we're, we're on a big momentum swing and we're going to, you know, keep our confidence at this all time high. You guys had the best shooting percentage, I think, of the season so far. What went right when you guys were basically hitting everything? I mean, just move, moving the ball, you know, dissecting their defense, keep it, keep it moving, you know, not let anything get stagnant, uh, things like that. How much fun is it when you guys you know, seem to be clicking? The way it's so guys. fun. It's really fun. You know, I mean, I, I didn't think I was going to have this much fun this year. And, and, you know, just being able to do it with these guys and, and you know, the the friends I've made along the way as well with these guys is definitely something special. Cal, how do you describe what you're doing? Well, we just stay focused, you know. We're focused on getting wins. We're just focused on playing basketball. What's your feeling when your guy Kyle goes down with an ankle? What's your feeling? Woo! You know, I know he's going to bounce back up, but it might take him a second, you know. <laughs> As a big guy, I know how it feels to get an ankle tweak. It hurts like it ever could be. But, you know, I feel like whenever he came back in, he still was kept firing threes up and they were hit he was hitting them. You know, I just love it, you know, being able to be to step out and with an injury and still be able to come back in and be able to be that much of a force is something that not that many, not that many people can do. Did you, you get some dab yeah, with Shire after you hit your corner three? Yeah, yeah, that was where I'm for sure. I thought I, thought I caught that. Though. Yeah, you know, uh, that's what me, me, me and Will have been working on, uh, just expanding my game, making sure I'm shooting from the top of the key, corners, wings, just being able to be focused and comfortable with the ball in any position. You stepped right into starting to take that, that, that play away from you, that three-point shot. Now. All I know is if they're going to take that shot away from me, it's opening another shot for my teammates, you know? If they're going to fly out at me, I'm gonna pass the ball, I'm gonna make the next play and make the right play. You step right into it though, like you didn't you didn't hesitate. You know, uh, it's something we've been working on for sure. You know, early mornings, day after day after day, making sure you're getting your shots up, making sure you're getting your form right, and just making sure you're staying consistent, you know? How much fun is it when you guys are just hitting the way you guys were today? It's a great atmosphere, you know? I feel like each and every one of us knows what the next person's gonna do before they do it, you know? I feel like that's trust, that takes a lot of time, it takes a lot of work. We finally got in there, you know? I feel like we're we're right at a great spot for being a team where I feel like everyone has their head in the game and everyone's full throttle. This doesn't look like four freshmen playing in their first postseason game. Yeah. I mean... <laughs> the ACC tournament is definitely a spot where you lock in, you know? It, put everything behind you, put everything anyone else has to say behind you. You know, you might be, people might say you're soft, people might say you're young, people say you're inexperienced, you don't need to listen. You know, you just focus on your game, you do what you can do to win, and we came out on top, unfortunately. Seven straight wins, do you remember what it feels like to win? 
uh, you got to know how it feels to lose, you know. You got to have that fear to lose to be able to win, you know. I feel like that's something that, you know, we took for granted at the beginning of the year. You know, we felt like we could never lose. But once that happens a couple of times, you got to put your head down, you know. You got to lock in. You just got to do everything you can to win. How bad do you guys want to beat Miami this coming down? You know, they're a great team. We're one-on-one. -on -one. They, they, the, they kicked the ass last time. But, you know, being able to just be in this position to get back at them is a great position, you know. It's going to be it's going to be a team, whoever, who comes out, whoever comes out and hits first, who, who's able to hit back harder, you know. Gotcha. How are you?